As you might imagine, the final night before the plane leaves for the South Pacific Arts Festival in New Guinea is filled with nervousness and anticipation, especially when just a few days ago, Guam wasn't even going to the event. With a last-minute appropriation of funds by Senator Carmen Kasperbauer and the persistence of a local travel agent, Guam is on its way to one of the world's biggest gatherings of artists, craftsmen, and entertainers. To shake out the jitters of a dream-come-true adventure, Guam's delegates to the festival held a pre-New Guinea warm-up, where island singers J.D. Crutch and Chuck McJohn announced they, too, are traveling to the festival. J.D., uh, are you going to be able to make it to New, to New Guinea this, uh, this coming uh, festival? Yeah. The whole band? No. Uh, well, we're trying to take, you know, find out, because right now the only thing I know is that I'm going. Now we're trying to find out whether he is going or not. What do you think, John? Can you get the band together for this? Uh, uh, I think we're just the, the two of us are going to go. We're gonna, that's what we're trying to do right now. Uh, one of our band members is in Japan right now anyway, so, but the two of us, this is like our back porch jam, yeah. no, Brett? So, uh, we're going to try to do it this style, this acoustic style, chamorro style, you know. It's all cultural. The whole show is, depicts the lifestyle and culture of Guam. Legends. The legends of Guam. Um, the first part is all um, legends before pre-war, um, pre-Spanish um, era, and the second part is traditional music music and dance with the trip costing about twenty one hundred dollars for each entertainer the performers travel agent Dolores Baza says the efforts of Senator Kasperbauer make the endeavor possible and luckily Senator Kasperbauer was able to come through with some kind of funding for the participants like from Guam going Guam had to show every other island in the South Pacific was showing except Guam until last week right someone has to show we have to come all of Guam parts of Guam each part being in this room full of entertainers who are heading out to the New Guinea Festival, you can't help but feel proud that with the effort of a few people, Guam will be represented this year. This is Clay Feeder reporting for Cable News. Oh, <laughs>